Now we go to Lockwood, where two families lost their homes to a fire over the weekend. But the landlord says it could have been a lot worse if it wasn't for one of our tenants who noticed the fire before it spread. Q2's David J caught up with one of the families and the woman who saved the day. This was a beautiful royal blue 2007 Denali that I've had for about four months. Ristan's mom had given us when I had my oldest daughter. These came from his great grandma. Mary Thody walks through her home destroyed by fire on Saturday. Every time you breathe in, it's like burn. It was burning my throat, and I can only imagine my girls. It was burning my eyes. It, it was just a big, heavy layer. You couldn't even see through it. So yeah, it took probably 30 seconds after the window shadow shattered in the kitchen to completely start filling the house. And he just pushed past me, which was fine because he had both my kids. Reston Thody was able to grab his two daughters and run outside. Got the back door open and rounded up the girls and got them outside and. That was, that was about all the time we had there. The Thodies found out about the fire from the neighbor. And I heard the garage door open, which scared me because nobody should be opening the garage door. So I ran out to see what was going on and I just poked my head out and I looked and I saw the fire over here. So I felt like the Lord opened that garage door and got my attention. I really do. If that's not the epitome of a heroine, you know what, if that's not an definition for it what is this could have turned out a lot worse um so yeah jeanette saved our family in lockwood david j mtn news the lockwood fire department has yet to release the cause of the fire stick